How to Supplement Cancer Treatment with Aromatherapy If you are looking for some complementary cancer treatment to cope with some of the symptoms and side effects of cancer treatment, you might consider aromatherapy. Aromatherapy stimulates receptors in your nose that send messages to the part of your brain that is responsible for emotions, which is called the limbic system. This is not a medical treatment and there is no guarantee it will work, but it may be worth a try. It can be a good way of relieving stress, anxiety, pain or nausea during the process of getting conventional treatment. You can apply aromatherapy oils directly to your skin, put them in a bath, or diffuse them in your bedroom. For effective relief, it is best to get the advice of an aromatherapist or aromatherapy consultant. Method 1 Using Specific Scents to Treat Side Effects 1. Use bergamot to reduce stress and anxiety. Use bergamot to reduce the daily stress of cancer treatment. Bergamot is a citrus fruit whose rind is used to make the essential oil of the same name, which can be found in certain drinks like early gray tea. Bergamot is a tonic that relieves nervous tension, aids in digestion, and relaxes the body. It also has stimulating and anti-depressive properties, which can induce feelings of joy and increased energy. Talk to your doctor about using bergamot aromatherapy to supplement your treatment plan. If you enjoy black tea, try drinking Earl Grey tea which contains bergamot. Put a few drops of bergamot essential oil in an essential oil diffuser in your bedroom. You can purchase bergamot essential oil at your local health food store. You will only need a few drops each time, so a small bottle should last a long time. 2. Enjoy lavender scents to relieve stress during cancer treatment. If you are experiencing a lot of stress and anxiety during your cancer treatment, you may want to smell some lavender. Lavender is great for improving sleep and reducing anxiety and emotional stress. If you are looking for some stress relief after a day of cancer-related treatment, put a few drops of lavender oil in a diffuser, by your bed or in the living room. Enjoy the scent of lavender before falling asleep. Chat with your doctor about using lavender to help with stress and anxiety. You can purchase lavender essential oil at your local health food store. You will only need a few drops each time, so a small bottle should last a long time. 3. Inhale peppermint to boost your energy levels. If you feel like your energy levels have really fallen from the cancer treatment, it might help to smell some peppermint in the morning. Peppermint essential oil is also supposed to be good for reducing chemotherapy-related nausea. Ask your doctor if peppermint scents may help increase your energy levels. 4. Use chamomile for chronic pain. If you experience cancer-related chronic pain, you might consider integrating chamomile essential oil in your arsenal of coping strategies. Try putting a few drops of chamomile in your diffuser beside your bed at night. Tell your doctor you want to try using chamomile to deal with chronic pain. You could also ask your massage therapist to give you a massage with chamomile essential oil. Pick up a small bottle of chamomile from your local health food store and use a few drops each time. 5. Smell Essential Ginger Oil Ginger oil can help you cope with chemotherapy-related nausea. Ginger oil is great for treating stomach-related problems as well as nausea and vomiting. If you don't have any essential oil on hand, you could also try drinking some ginger tea. Pick up some essential ginger oil from your health food store and use a few drops each time. Ask your doctor if ginger oil might help with the nausea. Method 2 Getting Professional Therapy 1. Find an aromatherapist. Get an appointment with a professional aromatherapist. An aromatherapist is a practitioner who has been trained in the use of essential oils and is also registered in a hands-on therapy such as nursing or massage. Aromatherapists are also often registered as acupuncturists or have knowledge of other alternative modalities. They will be able to administer the aromatherapy treatment and teach you how to safely use essential oils. When searching for an aromatherapist, you should ask if they have any prior experience treating cancer patients. Ask your medical doctor for a referral to an aromatherapist. There is no international standard for aromatherapy, so you will have to look into the required credentials for aromatherapists in your region. Search the website of the National Association for Holistic Aromatherapy. You can search the this website to find an aromatherapist in your country and region. Find an aromatherapist on the Aromatherapy Registration Council website. Aromatherapy is not FDA regulated. 2. Find an aromatherapy consultant. 
An aromatherapy consultant has been trained in the use of essential oils but is not a hands-on therapist such as a nurse or massage therapist. An aromatherapy consultant can give you advice on which essential oils to use and how to use them, but will not be able to administer the hands-on treatment. However, an aromatherapy consultant will offer consultation services that may include detailed advice on how to treat your particular condition, recommended resources, and a sample blend of essential oils. You can search the National Association for Holistic Aromatherapy website to find an aromatherapy consultant in your country and region. You could ask for consultation on the use of essential oils to treat side effects of cancer treatment. 3. Get aromatherapy treatment at your local spa. You can find aromatherapy treatment options at most local spas. You should ask your local spa whether they have a certified aromatherapist or aromatherapy consultant on staff. Follow up by asking them if you can get hands-on treatment from someone with training in aromatherapy. Try asking the following questions. Do you have anyone on staff with aromatherapy training? Do you have any registered massage therapists who are also trained in aromatherapy? Do you have any specialized aromatherapy treatment options or packages? Do you have aromatherapy treatment for individuals who are undergoing cancer treatment? Method 3 Treating Yourself to Aromatherapy at Home 1. Get an essential oil diffuser. An essential oil diffuser is a small device that gets essential oil particles into the air in your home. Inexpensive diffusers use small tea light candles to heat up essential oils and can be found at home appliance and health food stores as well as online. If you are wanting something a little more consistent and longer lasting, there are a variety of plug in diffusers that will work overnight or for the length of a work day, e.g., 6 8 hours. Another factor is whether the diffuser uses heat or another method to distribute the essential oils, since heat may alter the properties of the essential oils and reduce their health benefits. If you want to maximize possible health benefits, you should find a nebulizer cold air diffuser or an ultrasonic type diffuser. If you are diffusing in a small space, an evaporative diffuser may be a good option. Prices range from $5 to $100 for most diffusers, although there are also more expensive models. 2. Drop some essential oils in a glass of hot water. If you do not have enough money to purchase an essential oil diffuser, you can always drop some essential oils in a glass of hot water. Let the steam from the hot water evaporate in a hot room and experience the fragrant aromas. Do not drink the water with the essential oils. It is not safe to drink or consume essential oils. 3. Treat yourself to a massage with essential oils. Get a massage therapist to give you a massage with essential oils. Ask them to use an essential oil that is beneficial for side effects of cancer treatment such as peppermint, ginger, chamomile, lavender, or other essential oils. The combination of massage and essential oils should help reduce some of the stress and anxiety that is associated with receiving cancer treatment. Get your partner to give you an aromatherapy massage. If you do not have money for a professional massage, you could ask your partner to give you a massage using some massage oil and essential oils. For example, you could ask them to give you a massage with a massage oil that contains essential oils for stress reduction like lavender or elong elong. When applied directly to your skin, essential oils can have side effects such as allergic reactions, sun sensitivity and skin reactions. 4. Take a bath with essential oils. To get some relief from the daily stress of cancer treatment, you could always take a bath with some lavender, rose or vetiver essential oils. These essential oils are great for reducing stress and anxiety. You can also get bath soaps and bombs that have essential oils in them. Look for bath bombs or soaps in your local beauty or health store.